Okay, today, say hi guys. Hi! Today we're going to make our very own lava bottles. Woo! So, all you need for this experiment is you need water bottles. Water with water in it. Emptied about a third of the water. You need vegetable oil. Mine almost spilled. Water. You need a funnel, although that's optional. And you need food coloring and Alka-Seltzer tablets. So the first thing you do is you start with your bottle, about two-thirds full of water. Then you're going to take your funnel, put it in the bottle, and very slowly pour the vegetable oil into the funnel to fill the, almost the rest of the bottle. Do you need help? Or do you need help? Whoa. Okay, that's good. Good job. And if you notice, while I'm explaining this, everybody else is going to go ahead and do it. If you notice, the oil, which is less dense than the water, floats on top. That's called immiscible. Immiscible fluids do not mix. It's fuller. It's more yep. full. So then the next step, while everybody else is doing their part, Max, will you help it, all three, all the other two? While they're doing that, you're going to pick your favorite food coloring. Okay, and you're going to drop three drops of the food coloring, three to five drops of the food coloring, into the mixture. So you can mix it. Go ahead, yep. And what you're going to see is the drops actually pool up until they fall to the bottom and make mix with the water. They do not mix with the oil. Okay, so we see that our mixture is starting to, or our, our food coloring is starting to mix with the water because they are miscible substances, substances that mix. I added red and green, and it looks like I cut myself and added blood in it. Like a lot. CC, do you like it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do, so this is our mixture, and to make it look like a lava bottle, we're going to take our Alka Seltzer, and you don't need a lot. One tablet should be enough. Okay. Why is it my mixing? So, oh, take it out. Take the tablet out of the package. Oh. It's everybody's And you're going to try and break the tablet in half. And you're going to drop both halves into the mixture. And what's going to happen is, it's going to fizz up. And the food coloring is going to mix and create a... Stream of bubbles as long as the water dissolves the Alka-Seltzer Alka tablet. And the food coloring will mix with my lava. And you can see the bubbles going up and down and up and down. And you can actually keep this. And every time you add Alka-Seltzer tablets, this will happen. One thing you want to be careful of, if you notice, there is no top. If you put a top on here, pressure will build up and your bottle could eventually break and explode. So we want to be careful to make sure if we're adding Alka-Seltzer, we're not putting the top on our bottle. It's going to overflow a little bit, and that's okay. We're ready. We've got some paper towels here just in case. So that's our lava bottle experiment. Another thing you can do once it's done, if you shine a flashlight at the bottom of the bottle, it should create a light all the way through and make it look almost like a lava lamp. So this is something you can try at home. Have fun and get messy.